Hi everybody, it's Amy from the Backyard Greenhouse. We're at the home of Jeanette and John Radanovich and we're gonna go around their yards today and, and show you some of the cool things like they have behind me here um, and some flowers and some just different ideas for you to, um, to uh, get inspired by. So don't forget to like and comment and share below for your chance to win a prize from the Backyard Greenhouse. Thanks. and fenced in, nice and tall here. Keep up critters. Looks like you use rice holes. It's a great um, weed barrier and stops um, some of the blight and that sort of thing from getting on your tomatoes over there. Very cute little garden. Use of an old door, perfect. of interest with little statues that she's picked up along the way. Beautiful impatience here. Relaxing. Look at this porch. Cute. I wouldn't want to sit up there. Big Annabelle, Andrew Angel. Dogwood. Another nice little Lots of nice little seating areas around for people to relax. This is my favorite though. This is Jeanette's reseeded. All, all of these have been planted in years previous and she, they just come up every year. And this, in the spring this garden is just a solid color of yellow and purple. It's beautiful. This is a newer garden, isn't it? So this is an interesting thing. She's taken like just three old pots. They're all different. And she just painted them a copper color and then you know made the biggest one and the second and then the third and just planted a three-tiered what a fun idea look at that that's so cool Oops. i don't know if you can see the color in this video but... and then she's just got like another little chair here and a wagon full of flowers just lots of little corners of fun little things to do. Look at all this. This is all moss rose in here and some coleus. Um, on the bottom over there she's got um, verbena right here and then some dusty miller and then a beautiful thing of coleus and sweet potato vine in this big planter and then a spike which is kind of getting dwarfed at the top but that's a really cool idea. And, and you can find pick up old pick up some old pots at our garage sale and paint them with some Krylon or some Rust-Oleum from the hardware store and you got yourself a new planter. Oops, sorry, <laughs> and this is Jeanette's wisteria vine here. Look at that. Beautiful. That's a nice big arch she's got going into her vegetable garden. And then this, this is a stilby along here. And some uh, daylily. And some more uh, viola growing here. Probably seeded itself. Nice, beautiful little entrance to this. Jeanette has taken some cute little old bird houses and just planted a little bit of flowers in it and then just one hanging real nice and pretty. Nice little, nice little um, trinkets and ornaments all over in this yard. 